right, welcome to the Jason Coleman Show. It's another Sunday here from our home to yours, and Natalie, Avery, and I welcome you once again for another piano concert. This is episode number 71 today, and just like always, we've got a concert in store in the signature piano style of my grandfather, Floyd Kramer. Whether it's your first time tuning in or you've been along for the ride for uh, two years or more, we're glad to have you here today for what's going to be a really great day of music. In today's show, we are continuing where we left off last week with even more legendary ladies of country music. So today's the second half of what I split into a two-part episode because there are so many of these ladies to cover. We started last week by remembering our greatest female country artists who have passed away, but who left behind their incredible music like Patsy Cline and Tammy Wynette and many more. But in today's show, we are covering our living legends, the leading ladies of country music who've been making their mark on the industry and on all of our hearts and minds for decades, and they're still going strong today. And just like with last week, the list of these legendary ladies is a lot longer than what one show or even really two or three shows probably would allow. So don't take it personally, please, if you don't hear your favorite leading lady today. I'm doing my best to cover as many as I can, but make sure that you leave a comment there on who your favorite performers are so that in the future, maybe I can cover them in, in another show. Because the good news is the Jason Coleman Show is every week, so stick around long enough and there's a good chance that you'll hear your favorite soon enough. But I bet you'll hear a few songs today that you'll like. First up, though, I had to pay tribute to the coal miner's daughter, of course, and one of country music's greatest singers and songwriters of all time, Loretta Lynn, who's about to turn 90 years old. Our next legendary lady of country, though, like Loretta Lynn, she's a longtime member of the Grand Ole Opry, and she's a member of the Country Music Hall of Fame. And there's something about her voice and her presence that is just hard not to love. I'll play now for you her debut song from 1964. It's Once a Day by Connie Smith. Thank you. 
Crystal Gale, Don't It Make My Brown Eyes Blue from 1977. Another legendary lady of country music, the youngest sister, of course, of Loretta Lynn, but their styles were about as different as night and day. And Crystal certainly charted her own course through country music history with a uh, long career, a long list of awards and accolades, and of course, that long hair that we all know her for. In fact, <laughs> I remember when I was nine years old, I got the chance to perform with my granddad on uh, TNN, that Music City Tonight show, which many of you probably have seen that video uh, here online or, or at some of my concerts that I, I share it. And uh, you know, Crystal Gale was actually co-hosting the show that night with Lori Ann Crook. And I remember her as, an, as when I was nine, you know, she was so sweet, but I remember being so fascinated by that long hair. I was thinking like, what does she do when she sits down? Does she sit on it? But you know, of course she didn't. She handled it just fine, like a pro. It's so beautiful and such a, a wonderful, wonderful lady and a true ambassador for country music even now today. Our next living legend though that we're gonna cover in today's legendary Ladies of Country show, she has sold now more than 100 million records. She's received the Grammy Lifetime Achievement Award and she's a member of the Rock and Roll, Rockabilly, and Country Music Halls of Fame. Her career started at age 10, and the song I'll play for you now, she recorded at just 15 years old with Floyd Kramer on the piano for this record. The song I'll play now is I'm Sorry, and the legendary lady is Little Miss Dynamite, Brenda Lee. Continuing on now with more legendary ladies of country. By the way, today's show, remember, is part two. Last week we had a piano concert honoring our legendary ladies of the past, and today we're celebrating our living legends. If you missed last week's show or any of our previous 70 episodes from the last two years, remember you can always watch those on my website, jasoncolemanmusic.com, and make sure that you're following me on Facebook and subscribed to my YouTube channel and you'll never miss an episode of The Jason Coleman Show. But now on to another of our legendary ladies. 
This next artist has been a, a part of the Grand Ole Opry for nearly 55 years. And during that time, she has been a constant, faithful presence on the Opry stage. In fact, if you tuned in any time over the last 55 years, chances are she's been on stage and she is still rocking today better than ever. I'm talking about Miss Country Soul, Jeannie Seeley. I'll play a song now that she recorded in 1967, which won her a Grammy. And this song featured Floyd Kramer on the piano on that original record. This is Jeannie Seeley's Don't Touch Me.
Delta Dawn, the legendary Tanya Tucker. It's a song that everybody knows. In fact, I bet you were singing along with it when I was playing it just now, right? Released in 1972, which means that this song turns 50 years old this year. Can you believe, by the way, that she recorded the song when she was just 13 years old? And if you know the song and you know her voice, it doesn't sound like any 13-year-old I know. That is for sure. Speaking now of voices unlike any other, let's pay tribute to one more legendary lady of country, and she needs no introduction. some Dolly Parton in this house and on that note when you're married to the world's biggest Dolly fan right my wife Natalie Coleman you can't get away with just playing one song you got to do two songs so here we go another song in tribute to the legendary Dolly Parton
Patrick's Day. Happy、yes. St. Patrick's Day, <laughs> as Avery says. Hope y'all have had a big、uh, week. Avery has had a lucky week. He's got a lucky life, though. We got the lucky life with Mr.、Uh, Irish boy here.、Leprechaun. Look at the leprechaun.、He's、so cute. Oh, it's been a great week. It's been a great day here on the Jason Coleman Show, but we're not quite done yet. We have a special guest performance, but today we're going to give Avery a break from our piano here in the living room and let you all watch what Avery's been up to here lately with Daddy on the road. We've had some、uh, fun performing some concerts. In fact, earlier this month we were in North Carolina for a couple of shows, and Avery joined me on stage. So, Avery, do you think we can let our friends watch some of our video from when we were on stage together? Would that be a good idea? So, here, here's what I think we should do. Avery, Can you introduce yourself for this next video so we can watch Avery? All right, do it really loud. Ready? Ladies and gentlemen, would you please make welcome Avery Kramer Coleman? <laughs> Good job. Here we go. Let's take a look. He's been playing dance since he was two years old, and now he's a grand total of four years old. Would you please make welcome Mama Boy, Mr.、Go. Avery Kramer Coleman? So we're going to play a good old song that his great granddad played on the original record. It's called O、oh、Lonesome Me. All right, here you go. Ready? Looks like you're not right here. Here we go. Ready? <laughs>
Well, I don't know about you, but I have had a blast today. <laughs> thanks to Avery, to Natalie, and thanks to each of you for tuning in to uh, episode number 71 here of the Jason Coleman Show today. And remember, if you want to go back and rewatch any of our previous 70 episodes or today's episode as well, you can do that online on demand for free from my website, jasoncolemanmusic.com. You can tune in each Sunday afternoon at 4 p.m. Central Time for a new episode here on Facebook or on YouTube. And make sure that you're following me on Facebook and YouTube to uh, never miss an episode. Also, don't forget to listen to our radio edition of The Jason Coleman Show, airing each week on WSM Radio, Sunday nights at 8 p.m. Central Time. Anyone can listen to it from anywhere online at WSMRadio.com. Y'all, we are so thankful for all the ways that you show your support week in and week out. We love getting your emails and your messages and your comments, and we even love getting some of you will send a card in the mail, and it just makes our day when we get that. It means the world to us to know just how much that this music means to so many of you. So for all of our family to you, thank you for continuing to make it possible for us to get to do what we do. I'll close today as I do every week with one final song, and this is the song that seems to mean the most to the most of you. In honor of my grandfather, Floyd Kramer, I'll sign off today with Last Date. Your favorite songs from The Jason Coleman Show are now available on CD. First, the timeless music of Glenn Campbell. The smooth sounds of The Carpenters. And the smash hits of Roy Orbison. a concert of Christmas hymns from the heart and the
the young years, a concert from my granddad Floyd Kramer's childhood piano. These five new CDs join my other live from the Jason Coleman Show releases, including Hymns from the Heart and the Country Gold three CD anthology. These live from the Jason Coleman Show CDs are on sale now. You can buy them individually or get them in special bundles at a discount. Order online at jasonmusicstore.com or call 833-633-8885 to order over the phone. So if you're a fan of our Sunday shows, now you can enjoy all these great songs on CD, live from the Jason Coleman Show. Order yours today. You're listening to The Jason Coleman Show on WSM Radio.